The Playboy Empire's top dog, Hugh Hefner, comes downstairs to check on Shara, Willa, and Charlie. How are you? How are you, sir? Very well. Thank you. Hi, Good. cutie. <laughs> there you go. Are they behaving themselves or are they misbehaving? They're much better than they usually are right now. <laughs> yeah. They really well. are. <laughs> So normally, what do we see normally? What do you guys experience normally? She goes through this sort of phony Yeah. You know when we give treats out at night, sometimes they kind of get aggressive. They get aggressive around food. Food, they, yeah. If they, sure. Especially those Most treats. So. animals do. Yeah. Willa, she hasn't really good sit. No. See, I don't, that's not good. Yeah, so I don't want this? her doing that. Yeah, so here. There you go, and then you reward that. Nice. As soon as they put the rear in the ground, then you reward. Eventually, you let them wait with the rear in the ground three seconds, four seconds, five seconds. So it's never the same amount of time. Mm -hmm. If you go to Mexico, dogs wait. So dogs in the country wait. <laughs> dogs in America don't You're wait. You're too spoiled, well, right? Very, very American dogs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, they don't wait. people don't make the dog wait, mm -hmm. or people don't lead the dog. The dog lead the human. Yeah. If you don't tell them, they're going to tell you. It's one or the other. Oh, okay. Yeah. My pleasure. Thank you. Yes. And then, of course, I got to meet Charlie, and Charlie, Charlie was a little bit more insecure, a little too sensitive. This is for Charlie, right? Mm -hmm. We want, we're gonna feed Charlie. We're not feeding Charlie so we can empower him with leadership or dominance. We're just teaching Willa to wait what Charlie eats. Then Charlie feels okay. That guy is protecting me, so I don't have to worry about for her. So she just go into a waiting stage. There you go. Then because she waits, then we bring the plate to her. So she never goes to the plate. The plate comes to her because she did something for it. When Caesar was showing me how to feed the dogs, I realized to avoid the problem wasn't really fixing it. So that really is something that just so tiny of an adjustment, but it made the world of a difference. See, it wasn't a push. I just block. Uh -huh. Right? So I catch her by surprise, that's why she did that. There you go. And then they go into a waiting state. When you push, they come right back. Follow what I mean? Yeah. Let's do it again. We're gonna do Charlie, Charlie again. Nope. Nice. Nope. And then when he's done, then I can give her one, right? That's right. Nope. So what you're seeing is, because the brain never goes into excited state or dominant state, you will never hear growl. Mm -hmm. So it's always about waiting then, right? That's a calm submiss state. See, so when the mind is waiting, you get the obedience that everybody wants. Yeah. 